Hey nerds, welcome to Jerry Bear Reacts. Today we're going to react to Season 6, Episode 13, a.k.a. The Season 6 Finale. Episode 84 of The 100 is right here. Once we finish this, we have 16 episodes left. They're all in Season 7. We're wrapping up. Oh, man, hype, right? If you're new here, feel free to subscribe for daily content. Did I say that right? Uh, if there's a day, there's a reaction. Links are in the description box down below for the Patreon, the Twitch stream, and everything in between on Patreon. Once this video is finished, you can watch all 84 episodes here of The 100. All 171 of The Vampire Diaries, 92 of the originals, 100 of Teen Wolf, etc., etc. for all the MCU shows and everything else we've watched on the side. But besides that, um, all that stuff is down in the description box. Jerry's going to do his best work behind the scenes in just a second. The last episode felt like a really good finale. We'll see how this wraps up now with our Allegis 3 people. Russell and company, Simone and Clarkafine, Josek up there in space with Indra and Nyla. We'll see what happens on the planet with Bellamy and company with Jonathan and Amori staying behind. We're just going to see what happens. If you've been here for all 93 episodes so far, now I'm cutting this one. Like I said to the Patreon peeps, thank you. I love you very much. Hopefully you'll stick around for the rest of it. We'll see what happens in season seven, which I've heard already from you guys. Gets a little weird. I'm ready for it. So regardless, this is the wrap up for this. Tomorrow, remember, before we get into the episode, tomorrow there will not be a reaction. There will be a season six recap. And then we'll also, you'll see a poll for what show you want to see next. Simple as that. And that's all we'll say here in this episode. Again, Jerry does his best work behind the scenes. Let's get into the season six finale and let's see what's popping. Let's see how they wrap it up, baby. Abby, what are you doing? That's not Clark and Abby. Very good. Winner. Since we got our night blood, despite what I'm told you did with Kane. Now you have three seconds to stand down. Or what? If you kill them, we kill you. You didn't think this through. One. <laughs> Two. Weapons down. No. So that's my daughter, bro. I ain't taking no chance. What if she did, though? Stand what if she... Down. Clark's memories may suck, but they do come in handy. Gaia trying to talk to her a little bit because Gaia knows the situation, knows what's going on. What Just stay calm. Just stay calm, my friend. Did they wake up everybody or what's going on with that situation? Jesus, fuck, Maddie. You just got a whole bunch of people fucking for gonked, for killed. No one gives orders here but us. Hey, if Clark's got a reason to abuse her child, she gonna do so. She likes to do it. Ugh. Let him rot. Is that you spell? Ugh. UCH? I mean, that makes sense. Ugh. Lock it up. Lock it up, brother. Like, old girl knows what's up. I got sneeze. <laughs> Fuck the hundred. <laughs> Literally, the me seeing that logo pop up just eliminated that whole sneeze I was about to shoot out. Oh, I got nose hair. We'll watch the intro because it's the finale. I got it. Night, night juice. Wake your dumb ass up, baby. You murderers. Well, and that makes her one too. Good night. Your blood for the blood of Sanctum. Roll credits. Drink that shit. What is it? Is it goo goo juice? Good. Get the fuck up off me. Bro, I keep plucking those hairs and more keep taking their place. Oh, they're in here playing their roles. Fucking perfect, baby. What is the meaning of this? Blessed is Benjamin. Blessed is Caleb. Blessed are the crimes. Miller said. 
Adjustments are for our flock. <laughs> Why are the Earth people? <laughs> Never mind. This man, this man had to throw a wink, didn't he? There you go, Murphy. Hey, bro, get into it now. Don't be shameful. That was interesting. Another time, perhaps. Uh. Hey, Murphy, you gotta get into that shit, bro. Remember me. You gotta fucking slip a tongue in there, brother. Have you had any nosebleeds or memory flashes that aren't familiar? No. What are you talking about? She's trying to see if Abby still up oh, in that shit. something I saw in Clark's mind space. Their mother had the same neural mesh as she did. I thought they destroyed it with an EMP, but... They did. I examined her before resurrection. I wasn't about to make the same mistake twice. Just me. How the turntables. No, I don't see. I can't let you kill these people. Believe it or not, I am sorry for your loss. Don't listen to me. Oh, Look at the others. bro. I mean, it is still sad, man, because that is his daughter, you know, and Russell just has, like, I don't know. I think if it's anybody else, really wouldn't give a shit, but it is, it is Papa Argent. That's far enough. I set the inner door to stay open when I pull this, so you can put the guns down, or you can float. You heard her. Weapons down, now. Mom? She's bullshitting. She's bullshitting. Simone, what are you doing? Okay, okay. Damn. We're doing it. Clark, I've been pretending to. No. Go save Maddie. Don't move. Keep your hands where I can see them. What's my father's name? Oh, she done pulled that lock. Y'all getting... Oh, there goes a couple bodies. You're going back to your planet you came from. It's all right. <laughs> Damn, she had to stiff arm her like that. Well, there goes... There goes Abby. Officially. I mean, she was already gone, but still. It's not really a finale if Clark's not pulling some sort of lever, right? Clark's most stable relationships with levers. <laughs> like, I didn't be an emotional every episode. Imagine looking out the window in space. You see your fucking wife just out there with her mind drive. I'm surprised he hasn't just killed Maddie on sight just for principle. Don't mind me. I'm just going to open this up real quick. Mission accomplished. Jordan, we're here. You're safe. Lay him down. Jordan, who the you fuck you talking to, bro? They ain't even in there. Oh, never mind. They ran. In too deep to respond. Adjustment protocol. In too deep. And I'm going under. Only partially. Simone predicted that the bloodletting would deepen the religious experience. The psychoactive component is pure red sun toxin. This will stop. When used properly, it can be, yeah. Trey, you about dumber than a bag of fucking baloney. Wait for me. I can't let these people die, Bill. 
Yeah, she got she gotta get her redemption. Side by side. Like it was meant to be. Yup. Yup. I guess it's time to do better. Hey, Jonathan, I know it's a lot, bro. At your service. Amari. Come on, John. It's all right, bro. It's just a little redemption story. Yeah. Someone needs to stay behind and look after Miller and Jordan. That could be you. I'm sorry. Kaylee was against the adjustment protocol. Oh, let me give you a little smoochy smooch there. Yeah, man. Being a god should be more fun than this. I agree. Jordan back at like Doctor Strange looking at all the fucking possibilities of what's gonna happen. I killed his family. And now he's gonna kill mine. I won't let that happen. Right on cue, brother. A demon awoke one crew. Shut up. Take your gun, Nila, time your gaff in kick through. Bro, they really done had shade hate up in this mother lover telling people to kneel. The trigger. In three. Two. She's come up on I'm gonna. Damn, bro, I think Maddie just fucking did a kip up inside her own brain. She said, hold up now, brother. Oh, little Maddie and Clark. Oh, oh, is she in there fighting for her fucking life on a goddamn chessboard, bro? Maddie. She sees it. Get her up there. Maddie. Hurry. I got this weird feeling that I don't think... I've been having back and forth about if something bad's going to... Not something bad, but if they're going to kill uh, Russell or not. I think Russell stays. I don't know why. I think him and Clark have some weird connection of like friendship or understanding of mutual respect, something along those lines. But did it work? Oh, 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 hacking, signal lost. Is Maddie trapped in the flame? We don't like, she don't know, she doesn't know what the new catchphrase is, watch. Clark's probably always known. Scalpel, hands are too shaky. Come on, get somebody else to do it. It's okay. There we go. Who's who's helping her? Who's taking that? There you go, Jackson. Haley, it's me, Jackson. I'm in the season six finale, and they need help for me. And well, Abby's gone. I'm the only real doctor left here. Haley, I'm gonna go ahead and slice this little girl back her neck open. Four gotta get this goddamn gushers extreme out. All right, Haley, gotta go. We gotta focus. Oh, that shit was in there deep, bro. Motherfucker hugged Jackson too. Damn, I mean she's the one to lead the code, but Jackson was able to pull that shit out. Raven. I would have hugged Jackson and then Raven. I'd be like, Jackson, thank you for getting this out, and I would have gave Raven the longer hug, and then you see what I'm saying? Where does he go? Well There's mind drives out there, right? There's people in space with the mind drive. Mm, Clark's mind drive. Fucking I think a Murphy and a Mori have one in. Oh dude, Shade Hata and Murph. Welcome to the main event of the evening. Leave the torch and back away. Those are your people in there. Yeah, goof nut. Save them. That's what we're doing. Their sacrifice will be a blessing to That's us. not how that works, bro. I'll let you do that. Oh, swing and a miss. Ooh, watch out for that fire. No, I gotta get close to the motherfucker again. Oh, watch your foot there, bro. You catch on fire. Oh, me, oh, my, bro. Got a fuck fucking wrist slit bleeding into a petri dish cup. Fucking bang a bang a bongo. The toxins oh. quick in this host.
They're trying to burn you alive. There's Zebby, Debbie, Bebby, Webby. Oh, need him right in the fucking billy balls. Yeah, man. Oh, hell of a kisser. See? There you go. There you go. Fuck him up. 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 Come on, Bill. Actually, stab somebody. Like you did when they're. Pretend they're sleeping, bro. Kill him. <laughs> Ow! Okay, Donatello. She about to light her fucking self on fire. And the grace of the primes. That's how you know you bad shit, cuckoo fucking bonzo gonzo. Cuckoo for fucking cocoa puffs, bro. Flame on. That's one way to make s'mores. Oh, Octavia! up. Oh my fuck. Oh, Octavia's on fire. Oh, hand down, man down. Ooh, let me get this jacket off. When did you get that? What? What is it? Got markings on her back from the anomaly. Oh my god, it's the Zodiac Killer. Oof, bro. Oof. Look, they didn't offered him a mind drive. Immorality. Vitality. I don't know why I left the tally off there. Ah, little Miller and Jackie Jack. Ah, little Smoochie Smooch under the sun. Isn't that like, isn't that the thing that's on the logo on Netflix? Like that symbol? I've been waiting to see what the fuck that was about. Or what generates the magnetic field that holds it up. That symbol in the series is called an Octonian. Octonian, Octavia. Advanced mathematics way above my head. But I don't think it's coincidence you share a name. Please. It should be you. That's her full name, right? Octavia, Octonia, Blake. Last thing you gotta press is the O. See the tattoo again. No, it's working. Wrong. Quiet. Oh, that shit is spreading. You know, y'all done released another fucking prime fire on another planet. They didn't release the other one, but still. Who deals it? That's Deals' his daughter, bro. Hope. I couldn't get out of it. He has my mother. I'm so sorry, Octavia. Octavia! What's happening? He just... She just... She's got turned into green dust. Hashtag poof. Hashtag poof. Hope done showed up. She is at least 27. Now the anomaly goes back to normal. Uh, okay. <laughs> It definitely, definitely set up another focus. It definitely set up another season, right? That's a hundred percent what that just was. Like that outright set up another, the obviously fi fi final season. Uh, well, episode five kind of seemed like it could have just been like a end all, be all, cliffhanger ending. We're here on a new planet, blah blah blah. We don't know what's down there. Maybe they find peace. Maybe they don't. People are asleep. We'll wake them up. Blah, blah, blah. This is a. Uh, this was okay. This was an okay episode. I'll call it what it is. I think it, it sticks. One, two, and three had amazing finales. Uh, uh, 
Uh, four, five, and six. Well, season four's finale wasn't awful, by the way. I just want to put that out there. Just, it was pretty bad. Five and six, uh, It's this isn't in the same boat as those. I still think this finale is better than those two, but this is like, actually, I don't know. I have to wait. I got I to gotta think about it a little bit. It just doesn't feel really like a finale. It just feels like the end of an episode, right? It doesn't feel too much like a finale. They're going to go back up in space. They got people going back up to the anomaly. What happened to everybody else? Right? Like, did the anomaly affect them? Dioza's kid. So I, I know Dioza's going to be in the sec in the next season. Uh, that just makes... There's no reason she shouldn't be, unless the actor's just completely gone. Uh, I feel like she'll be in the next season. Her kid's here. We got hope. Uh, it just Octavia gets stuck back in the anomaly. Octavia will be in the anomaly. We have no idea what's going on with... Russell... Maddie kipped up, took them hostage. Here's how you make that scene better. Okay? I'm talking about the scene where they remove the chip. It's as simple as this. Unless they do something in season seven, the whole thing that's been running for a couple seasons, or maybe a season or two, is that Maddie changed the passphrase for the chip, for the flame. Rather than having Jackson cut it out, which I think he should have, you can do that same exact scene. Cut it. Jackson goes to try to pull it out. It gets sucked back into her neck, right? It's kind of dead, kind of alive. It's kind of like flickering a little bit. The flame is gone. We know Shade Hate is gone, but you see it like kind of powering down. Obviously, it makes sense he's able to remove it because it doesn't have any power. It's not like any sort of issue with that, but he goes to pull it out. It goes back in. It's flickering off and on. They know they have to know the passphrase and Clark's like I don't know what the passphrase or Gaia says you know she changed the passphrase blah 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 and then you have Clark like looking around like she normally does and then she has a moment where she's like oh duh of course this is what Maddie would change the catchphrase to she's my daughter why wouldn't she change it to this she says something it could be something that was between them it could be something that just they did it could have been the name of the berries they used to dye their hair red it could have been anything along those lines, something that connected those two together. And in that moment, it could have even, it could have been the name of a past character that we lost. It could have been, uh, the fucking past phrase could have been changed to Jasper Jordan. I don't know, man. It could have been, uh, Maya. It could have just been any other character. It could have been Lexa. It, it could have been something. Obviously you can't just say her name and the chip would pop out, but it would be something like that, that they knew together. That happens, it detaches. The second it detaches, it powers down. It's completely gone. And then Shade Hate's memory gets booted up. Wherever it just went. Another mind drive. Maybe into Clark. Shade Hate into Juan Hata? I mean... That would have made it a little bit better. Now, if they do something with the catchphrase in Season 7, ignore me. But I just think that that would have added two more minutes to the shot. And there you go. With this, the finale... This latter half of it, I don't know. It's a it's a good cliffhanging finale. Again, episode twelve, same deal with the last couple seasons. Is like this the episode beforehand feels more like a finale than the actual finale does. That's not necessarily a bad thing, but you do a little better. I do have to say, overall, season six is fire. Probably my favorite season of the entire show, easily. Like I love I love season one. I love them being on the ground. I love season two with the Mount Weather stuff because it all feels we're in post-apocalyptic. Season three, we get a little off the rails with the AI stuff, but I really love like who's gonna take who's taking the chip, who hasn't took the chip, blah, blah, blah. What's going on with Jaha? What's going on with Murphy? What's going on with these peeps? They're gonna be able to recruit these people. Oh my god, Raven took it. And then that suspense the entire time. Season three is fucking almost perfect. Then you get season four, which is like, hey, the earth's in and we gotta tell these people, we can't tell these people, we gotta do this. It's all about survival instincts. And then season five is season five. And then we get into season six. And it's just like, okay, we're on a new planet. It's almost like, kind of like a Mount Weather thing, but not really. But there's these people we can't really trust, but they're false gods. People are, could be trapped inside here. At least Clark is with the with the mesh thing. Abby's gone. We lose Clark. or We lose Clark for a moment. We lose Abby. We lose... Um, we lose Kane. I'm, we lose... Other people as well. I feel like we're about to lose Jordan. And I felt like Jordan was going to be such a huge character. And then ends up kind of taking the back seat when it felt like he was going to be at the forefront of a lot of stuff, especially with the early relationship with Delilah and everything. 
overall, I love this. So season six, episode 13, Gabriel and the others combat the true believers remaining in Sanctum. Clark shambles to prevent, scrambles to prevent the prize from escaping aboard the Allegis Four. We'll see what happens with Russell. I think he's the last prime. We'll see what happens with him. We'll see what happens with how Bellamy reacts to all this. We'll see what how Gabriel fits in to all that stuff moving forward. Do they go into the anomaly? I figured pressing that button, beep, bop, boop, maybe other people got pulled into the anomaly off screen that we didn't get to see. I figured pressing that would do something more than make the anomaly grow, but then it shrunk back down. Maybe it just wanted Octavia? So we'll find out. We have 16 episodes remaining. We have finished 84 episodes of the 100. 16 remain to get to that all-elusive number of 100. All 84 episodes are on Patreon. You guys can watch them whenever you want to. Links and everything are going to be in the description box down below. 16 episodes left with a wild journey. Tomorrow will be the recap, and then there will be a post with a poll for the next show. And we will vote on that for about a week. As we wrap up season seven, after season seven, of course, is the recap, is the full show recap, is character rankings, is watching the trailers and bloopers, etc. as we do for every other big show, all of that stuff. We're going to get into our second only season seven. The Vampire Diaries had a season seven. This is the only other show that's had a season seven. And uh, I think it's the only other show that's had a season six. Maybe The Hundred had a season six. I can't remember. But, uh, or not the 100, uh, Teen Wolf. I think it ended at five. Maybe it had a six. I can't think right off the top of my head. But regardless, that's it. The finale's done. Chef's kiss to this season. Links, again, and everything will be in the description box down below. Playlist will be up on screen. As always, stay cute, stay hydrated, and I will catch you on the season seven premiere, which is entitled From the Ashes. Mm -hmm. All right, see you there.